guys, welcome back. Um, today I'm just going to do a real quick um, Beauty Box 5 unboxing. This is my, um, geez, what month are we in? <laughs> November box. And I literally have been checking the mail all day long today. Um, I knew it was going to come at some point during the day because it just it comes around the same time each month. But like it took forever to get here. So, <laughs> so I'm just going to go ahead and show you what's inside. Um, go ahead and open it up. Looks like the card on top says gracefully grounded. I'm not sure what that means. And then there's some coupons and other stuff on top. And the first thing I see is something that I already own. Um, it's floss picks. And it's, I mean, I guess it comes in this cute little case here. So you can put them in your purse, which is kind of nice. I guess I like the case, but these are the kind of things I use for when I floss my teeth anyway. So I already have a ton of these things. Um, basically, it's just a little piece of floss that's stuck on a toothpick. Now I can't get the thing back open. Ah, how do you open? Okay. Basically, it's just a little toothpick with some floss on it. Um... Yeah, that's just kind of okay. I do like the little travel case, though, because this can actually go in my purse. Um, so that'll be nice to carry some little floss picks around with me, I guess. Next thing that I see in here is a sample size of some Dove body wash. Um, I thought it was shampoo for a second, but body wash is probably better because it says it's deep moisture. So... Um, yeah, I guess that'll be good for the winter time. It smells pretty good, too. I don't really use Dove products very often, but um, I'll definitely try it. It says softer, smoother skin after one shower. I could use that. Um, and it says a full-size bottle of this is $6.49. So, there's that. Next thing in here is probably the most intriguing thing to me. It is a little... Um, Laura Ashley Cherry Blossom Body Butter. Look how cute this is. This is probably the biggest product in the box. And I'm not sure if I'm familiar with the Laura Ashley. The name sounds familiar. I just don't own anything by them. Ooh, and it's got a safety seal. Wow. It's not sealed very securely, but it's on there. I can't smell anything. I guess it has like a faint scent to it, but it's not really, uh, I don't know. It's not really that great. Um, and it's kind of really, really watery. Do you see this? Like, it's almost like a gel more than like a body butter, I would expect. It's very, very thin. And as far as body butters go, you, you tend to think it's the opposite of that. Loki, please. I'm talking here, Loki. But, I mean, this is just not very impressive to me. I don't know. I The smell's not very strong, and also it just is, it's very watery going into your skin. I don't know. I'll definitely try it out for a while and see if it is, you know, nice and moisturizing or, or not. Um, and I can let you guys know. But that's kind of a letdown because I was excited to see such a, you know, generous sized product in the box. Um, it says that this body butter comes usually in a set of six and retails for $20. So we'll see about that. Next thing in here. Oh, Loki is just dying for attention today. Next thing I see in here is some very pretty uh, L'Oreal nail polish. And this is in the color, it doesn't tell me. Seriously? No color name? Really? Hmm. Yeah. Well, it says peel here. Maybe I can peel and find out what color it's called. Nope. Literally no color name. Sorry, guys. <laughs> but it is a very pretty, um, like, candy apple red. And I don't really have many reds like this in my collection, so that'll be kind of nice. Um, it says that the uh, 
L'Oreal Nail Color retails for $5.99. So yeah, that's not bad. Um, and then the last product in here, I'm kind of bummed because it's also something that I already own. Um, I bought this a while back at Sally and I can tell you for a fact it's not really very expensive. Yeah, it says $2.99, or $2.99 but I feel like I paid even less for that than that. Um, it is the Hask uh, Macadamia Oil um, Revitalizing Shine Hair Treatment. I bought this because I thought it was actually like a treatment, like a um, leave-in, rinse out, you know, some sort of like conditioner or something like that, or like a one-time treatment. You know, Sally sells a lot of those, like those little packets. I thought it was something like that. It's not. It's just um, some leave-in hair oil. And I already have a ton of argan oil from Sally. And now I have another one. So, um, I don't know. I might give this away to someone because it didn't really do anything for me. I can tell you for a fact now. Um, maybe if your hair is less dry than mine, it might work pretty well. I know a lot of people love macadamia oil, but I'm not a huge fan. Um, it does smell really good, though, if I remember correctly. Let me see if I can open it without getting it everywhere. Yeah. I mean, it smells good. All, I think all macadamia products smell pretty good, but yeah, just kind of not really anything new for me. Um, and so basically that is it for the box. Not really super exciting. I guess it will be nice to have a little carrying case for my floss picks so I can bring them with me to work if I feel like flossing more. Um, I think a lot of people will enjoy this hair oil. I just don't really appreciate it too much for my own hair. I don't think it works too well. Um, the... Uh, Body wash, I will definitely get use out of that because I like body washes and I'll use them a lot. Um, the Laura Ashley body butter, we'll have to see if this is any good. Um, I'm actually not a huge fan of cherry blossom scents in general, but um, and the consistency seems strange to me, but I'll throw it in my purse and just kind of like use it anyway and let you guys know if it's good or not. And then um, the nail polish, probably the best thing in the box because it is just absolutely gorgeous, and I will definitely get use out of this, especially for the holidays. It's a great color for the holidays. So overall, just kind of a letdown of a box. Um, but, I mean, there's some stuff in here that's pretty nice. So thumbs up if you guys enjoyed watching, um, and please comment and subscribe if you haven't already, because it means a lot to me. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye!